Hello Glamazons, it's me and this is the third time I had to film the last part of my fashion jewelry ring collection video. Oh my god, I'm so mad. This stupid iPhone, I don't know what's wrong with this stupid phone. It just would not film in landscape mode. So here we go, third time filming it. <sighs> just breathe. Anyway, <laughs> most of these rings came from Jewelry Guy back in the day. So... I'm not as enthusiastic because this is the third time I had to film it. Some butterflies here. Flowers. A lot of butterflies and flowers. I'm pretty sure all of these rings came from Jewelry Guy. This one's really pretty. But now at least I can try to try them on a little bit so you guys get an idea. Um... These are really, really pretty rings. Jewelry Guy is like the best stuff ever. These sparkle so much. I love them. It's gorgeous. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Yeah. See, very big ring. But yeah, these came from Jewelry Guy. Very fun, very, very fun jewelry. I love this type of jewelry in the summertime. You know, you're going to the beach or you're going somewhere, barbecues and picnics. You know, you don't have to worry about this kind of jewelry. If something happens to it, you know, it's whatever. Okay, so here's this box. I have a lot of duplicates in this box. This one is a locket. It opens up. This pretty ring here. This one is the same as this one up here. Vintage. This is a huge ring here. Very big ring. Some of these are just really, really, really pretty. Okay, this one is the same as this one here. Look at this one. Look at the craftsmanship on this one. Very pretty. Then we have a crown ring here. Let me see if I can get it out. It's a pretty crown. Then I have this ring here in two colors. So we got the antique color and the silver tone. This ring. It's a pretty ring here. A lot of these are like knuckle to knuckle rings. Knuckle rings? really pretty it looks like a piece of candy and this Aztec looking ring here and this silver tone here with the little teeny pearls is the same as this one in gunmetal and I have a pretty exotic looking one here then I have that same one I have it in purple blue and clear let me just give you guys an idea what it looks like okay, very pretty I cannot believe I had to film this video three times. It better come out right this time, otherwise I'm going to like scream. But anyway, these are some of my more expensive rings. This one came in a Victoria's Secret gift set. It's really pretty. Stretchy. It's beautiful. Very tropical looking. Uh, here I have a really pretty butterfly ring. Big, beautiful butterfly stretch ring. All of these rings are pretty. I love all of them, otherwise I wouldn't have bought them. Same ring as this one, but in black and white. Beautiful ombre butterfly ring. And then these rings here. This one was a pretty chocolate color and it turned on me without me even wearing it. So, it's hideous. I'm probably going to throw it in the garbage. It's really ugly, so I'm going to throw it in the garbage. But the silver one is really pretty. Um, let me... Like I said, just trying to slip some of these on so you guys can see. See how pretty that is? It's just so pretty. I enjoy my little baubles. I really do. <laughs> these I love because they sparkle like real diamonds. And they're stretch rings. So it's just really, really, really fun. Look at that. Reminds me of something uh, Mariah Carey would wear. <laughs> um, try this one. 
really, really pretty. I don't know why I didn't think to kind of model these for you guys earlier with the other three videos, but oh well. <laughs> uh, next box. These are my glamour rings. I wear these out when I'm going out someplace glamorous or dark. You know, I just think they're really pretty, really fancy looking. You know, if I had all the money in the world to afford South Sea pearls and diamonds, this is what the rings would look like. They're like Ma Bay pearls. I do have a Ma Bay pearl ring and I don't wear it. So I have a Ma Bay pearl ring and necklace set in gold that I don't wear. And it looks exactly like this. Um, just beautiful pearls. I really love this ring. Look at the craftsmanship on that one. Very pretty. Very, very, very pretty rings. Um, this one is the same ring as this one. Silver tone and gold tone. Then this huge one here. See, just big fun rings. Um, I like this for when I'm going someplace to have cocktails. You know what I mean? Like, look at how beautiful that is. Like, tell me that's just not pretty. You know what I'm saying? Like, very old school glamour very like glamorous um you know if I have a drink in my hand and the lights are twinkling and I'm taking pictures this is what I like like obviously I I don't wear rings like this to the supermarket but you know if I'm going out and I want to have a Malibu Bay breeze or amaretto sour when I go out this is what I would wear Anyway, let me hurry up. <laughs> Next box. These are my fancier rhinestone rings. These rings are not adjustable. They cost more. Pretty snake ring. I have a crown ring. This is a thumb ring. Florally thumb ring. Let me see if I can slide it on my thumb. See, very believable. Looks like diamonds. And these are platinum plated, so they wear just like real jewelry. That's why I keep them in a separate box. And I don't put them in my jewelry box because I'll get them mixed up with my real jewelry. Beautiful rings. Like, here's a dinner ring. I like to wear this one when I go out to dinner. I just think it's beautiful. Um, then, like, they're not adjustable. Beautiful snake ring. I mean, tell me that doesn't look like a million bucks. You know what I mean? Um, some of these still have tags on it, like this one. My vintage inspired ring. Wouldn't that be a pretty engagement ring? So pretty. Um, this one I get compliments on all the time. People think it's a real diamond ring. It's really pretty. Then I have this one here. It looks like emerald. Well, more like chrome diopside, actually. It looks like a perfect chrome diopside ring. Because I have some chrome rings and earrings that match this perfectly. Again, when I don't want to wear my real jewelry, I reach for stuff like this. This one's a really pretty ring. Look at the detailing on it. Like, it's just very detailed. It's too big for me, but I wear it anyway. I guess a man could wear this one, too. But, and this one's really pretty when I want to feel like a queen. It's gorgeous. <sighs> and then, in here, these cheap, nasty stack rings from Forever 21. Terrible. I bought them and the stones started falling out. They're just shitty quality. I hate Forever 21. They're big and clunky. They don't look real whatsoever. And they're all missing stones and everything after like one or two wears. Terrible. I should probably just throw them in the garbage. I might. Next box these beautiful rings here I bought these all at once because they remind me of the high school and college graduation rings my graduation ring was so expensive and I don't even wear it the one I got from high school it's ugly don't like it paid way too much money for it and so I didn't even bother to buy a college ring I just didn't bother um, <laughs> this one random, random one ring in here so I just think these are really pretty I like this one for the summertime. Look at the color. It's just a really pretty color. Um, but yeah, these look just like um, the graduation rings. So, 
if I feel like I want to wear the look of a college ring, I just put on one of these. They look just like it, like those Super Bowl and college rings. So, yeah. I'm pretty sure you've seen lots of people with college rings and high school rings that look just like this. And these weren't $600 like my high school ugly ass graduation ring. <laughs> Next, these pretty rings here. I bought it in four colors. This is a stone, it's not glitter. With this beautiful filigree ring here, pretty butterfly ring here, big beautiful green ring here. Look at the quality on that. If you see it, get it. This came from eBay. It's beautiful. Big flower ring here. Rose ring here. Another big flower ring there. Big gaudy ring that I love to wear at night because I think it's really pretty. And I just want a big gaudy ring. I throw this one on. I think it's pretty. Then this ring came from eBay and it opens. It's got a mirror in it so you can fix your lipstick and it's got fake little makeup in it and it's got a magnetic closure. And I just think these are really, really pretty. Very, very pretty. So, let me hurry up here. One more box to go. Isn't that pretty? So pretty. I enjoy my baubles very much. Last but not least, some more pearls. Look at these. They are gorgeous. Gorgeous, 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 gorgeous. Again, these are my fancier costume jewelry rings. This is the same ring as this one. Same ring. This one is the same as this one, just different colors. And I just think they're beautiful. This is a little cheap cameo ring. This ring here was only a dollar only a dollar it's cute and believe it or not sometimes I mix my real and fake like with this one here I'll pop on some sterling silver earrings or some real pearl earrings I have a pearl necklace that'll match this I mix and match my real and fake all the time so because I don't have that many real pearl rings I have like maybe five if that so I mix and match these with my real pearls. Um, these are just fabulous. I mean, look at that. Like, tell me that doesn't look like a million dollars. Seriously, you would never think that that was fake. It's just gorgeous. They look like designer rings. I have seen rings like this in New York City that cost an arm and a leg. Um... And they're worth it, you know what I mean? I just think these are so fun. Look at that, like that's just so fun. I mean, who doesn't love a big gaudy ring, you know? At least sometimes. Not all the time, but sometimes. This one's so cute. So cute. And then I like this one here. Pretty black and crystal rings, gorgeous. They're so cute. Like, you can wear this to someone's wedding. You know what I mean? Like, these can be really dressed up or dressed down. So, I really love them. This one's got all sorts of, like, little crystals and gems on it. It's really pretty. I have real pearls that match it. So, this concludes this video of my costume jewelry. This concludes my entire fashion jewelry ring collection, 99% minus one or two rings. I hope you all enjoy these videos. I hope this video came out right the third time. And that's it. Any questions, leave a comment below. Please hit like on Facebook and follow on Instagram. And I will talk to you guys later. Bye!